Hey guys, welcome back to Don't Starve Together in the game room. Hey guys. Been a minute since we've last played. Yeah, but I think we're gonna be just fine. Well, uh, you have some plans for us. Uh, yes. I am hoping to potentially fight the Eye of Terror today, which is gonna be pretty fun to do. I'll just need you to supply me with the resources to do so. And that shouldn't be too much of a hassle. Uh, I do need to go find some gold boulders, because I need the gold for it. But I have an idea of where I can get some, thankfully. Leave me alone, bees. Oh, come on, Lucy. Don't act like that. What's Lucy doing? Oh, she's just talking to me. Ah. Uh, I find it a bit odd that if you have Glomer following you, the marker for him will duplicate on the map because he is following you. I find it kind of funny that he does duplicate on the map. How many uh, helmets do you, would you say we need for this? Two for you, two for me. That could work. I don't expect to fight him tonight, but I think we'll be okay if we do. Match me, hounds. How does that even work? What happened? Tried setting down a piece of monster meat so I can pick up some fresh monster meat, and it stacked even though it was a pretty decent ways away. Sorry to hear. <laughs> It's whatever. Yeah, Lucy, there are trees around here. I'm just not cutting down anymore right now. Haha. Do you want me to clear out some of these hound mounts? If you could, that'd be very appreciated. Okay, there's no way that hit me. Obviously, it did. Let's see. Okay. It's a decent amount of gold here, so that's a few uh, battle spears and battle helms. How many rocks do you have? More than a stack. So, I also have that for it, too. You're also wanting to cut, make some crock pots as well? Yeah. Do we have any charcoal? I have 14 on me. Okay, yeah, we can we can begin food production for stuff. Well, if you're wanting to make or if you're wanting to place the crockpots, you're more than welcome to, since you know the orientation you want. Yep. Yeah, I can do that. Just wait for me to get back first. Well, of course. I can't do much anyways, except just sit by this fire. All right, is it now day fifteen? Okay, lag. Really likes doing that sometimes. Do you know if we have any gears? Uh, let me check real quick. We have two. Okay. Good to know. We only have two gears, though. We're gonna have to hold off on making nice spots, because the orientation I have planned for the kitchen requires at least six to be put down beforehand. Unfortunately. Why not just put three down for right now, and then in a single icebox, about half of it, and then the other half we can finish whenever we have the resources. I would if I could, but the way uh, structure placement works is that things like crockpots have a much larger room for requirement to be able to place them. Mm. And because of that, placing an icebox before any other crockpots would prevent us from placing down the rest of the crockpots. At least in the way that I want. I see. Well, you know, just a suggestion. Nothing's wrong with suggestions. Just wanted to let you know. Come here, butterfly. Easy. Killing things is so uh, menial with Wigfrid. Like, it, it's so easy. Well, the fact that you just hit harder in general is pretty nice. Yeah, it is. 
Actually, I do have an idea. We we can still place an ice box. It'll just be the ice box that we can that we are eventually going to use for seats. Oh, the one that's just outside the structured placement. Yeah. You are wanting to fight Eye of Terror tonight, right? Not necessarily tonight. Soon. Well, we have about six more days until it's winter. We could wait for winter to come. Uh, it would be somewhat better considering that you can only fight Eye of Terror at night and the nights are longer in winter. So Longer nights. Yeah. That doesn't sound too bad. I'm out of the, uh... Do you know where the pitchfork is? Right here. Okay. I thought it was in my inventory. Why can't I put this plum pudding on the tree? Because you don't put food on the tree, silly. Put, Unless it's cookies. I put the fruitcake on there. Then of course you put cookies on the tree. Because that's logic. Well, yeah. It's just a slice of the fruitcake. I wonder what knife was able to cut that. This is... You know how fruitcakes are indestructible? Um, I've actually never had fruitcake, so I wouldn't know if trading it like some god-awful thing would be accurate representation of what it is. Oh, trust me, you don't want a bite out of that. I've had some, and it's not the best. Not the best, but still edible, right? You could say that, sure. You could say it's edible. And depending on how it's made, it could either taste like actual fruit in a cake, or cardboard. Your choice. Well, preferably, I wouldn't want to eat something that tastes like cardboard. That's what I'm saying. Where do we have our gears stored? Oh, right there. Okay. Can you get some, uh... No, I, I can get it. I was gonna ask you to get some fire, or some fuel in the fire pit, but I got it. There we go. Uh, let's see. Alright there. I am sorry for the poor quality of the monster meat. It's stacked on its own. But otherwise, we have a fridge for whatever. Well, at least we have a start. Yes, that we do. I'll just eat this plum pudding. We're gonna need a garden thingamajig for this area, too. Is there really point in making a garden right now if it's almost winter? Well, we can get the layout for it, because unless we dig it up with a pitchfork, it'll last forever. That's true. Was it food and gardening? Yes, and it's three boards, two rope, and two flint. I mean, we have the wood. So we definitely have wood. That's right. I've been collecting it frequently enough to where we have a decent supply coming in. Well, I already have it. Oh. Alright then. Uh, I, I love how just any small task you do regarding gardening makes it play the gardening ambient music. I do find that kind of funny. Uh, where do you want this charcoal to go? Charcoal? Yeah. Oh, uh, you can put it in with the rest of this wood. Okay. I'm gonna make some meatballs for us. Can you leave one open for me so I can use it? Yeah. Because I'm gonna make some butter muffins. Good idea. Considering we do not have a birdcage yet, which I want to get, that'll essentially be your healing source. And since we gather so many butterflies anyways... Speaking of, I shall do a bit for you. And since only you can eat meat, all the butterflies go to me anyways. Yeah. So more butterfly muffins for me. That is one of the limitations I'm not particularly fond of. Your meatballs are finished. Thanks for letting me know. They are all the way out there, the beefalo. I need to go visit them tonight. By tonight? I need to go get some of their fur for winter. Ah. Uh, okay. That is false game. I am not starving and don't starve. That's the whole point of the game, is don't starve. Yeah, and I'm not starving. Together. And I'm starving. This shirt, bro. Hey, leave me alone, alright? No, you're starving. You're going against the word of the game. Well, what do you think I'm trying to do? I'm trying to rectify that issue by making food. But it's taking forever. That sounds like a you problem, good sir. A skill issue at best. This <laughs> is 
You know what? Maybe it is. And I'm fine with that. Are you, though? Not really. Are you truly fine with that? No. That's what I thought. So many butterflies that are spawning. Oh, I know. It's crazy. How's it looking? Oh, it's looking nice. Well, that's unfortunate. What happened? None of this detritus I'm digging up is giving anything. I mean, there is a chance that it doesn't, but all of them haven't. Ooh, should I do this hunt? Your choice, honestly. I'm gonna do it. If you're not using the other crop pot, can I use it? Uh, yeah. You're gonna get us some um, big meat. Oh, I need one more stick. Oh, I have it in my inventory. What am I worried about? Yep. What are you worried about, dude? I just don't want to dip into my supplies of sticks because it's almost winter. Alright, after these two butter muffins, I'm going to go talk to the beefalo and get their wool. Say hi for me, I suppose. Oh well. There you are. Just be careful that the hunt that you're following is not a varg. Um, if it is a varg, uh, I'll just leave it alone. Please do. We don't want that. We, we don't want to do that right now. The hunt's going all the way over toward the Mactus camp. That's pretty far. I'm past it. Yeah, it is. Is it still going? Don't tell me this is one of those hunts that's just gonna lead to nothing. Because there are hunts like that, unfortunately. Come on, where are you? Nearby, hopefully. It is nearby, but what is it? Oh, it's a qualifant! Ooh, perfect. But it's in the middle of a bunch of spiders. That's problematic. Oh, leave me alone. Hey guys. Jack says hi. Uh, leave me alone, spiders. I'm just trying to do other things right now. Like, hunt. You're not letting me hunt. You're helping out a bunch by doing this, guys. This is... Oh, you're talking to the beefalo. Yep. Alright, I got 12 wool, which should be good enough for... What, two winter hats? Uh, I believe so. Jeez, so many spiders! I'm now going insane. Jeez, dude. Calm down a bit. Don't need to go that hard with killing stuff. No, don't take my fire. Ow. I hear this qualifant snoring, but I don't know where it is. They took my fire. Uh oh. That's not good. I'll be okay though, I have a torch. Oh dang it. Now I have to actually chase this qualifant into a wall or something. That's a bit annoying. How'd you hit me? Uh oh. This is bad. Uh, what's happening? Terabeek. You're right, that is not good. Come on. If I can get to our flower field, I should be able to restore some sanity. Just let me hit you. Stay still. Alright, come on out, Lucy. I need your help. Uh oh, two Terabeeks. I say trying to chase it as I get stuck on something myself. What do you mean? Three, four. You share a beefalo attack pattern. And you're already dead. Are you doing better, Evan? No. Uh, still in a relatively uh, bad spot? Yeah. I'm sorry. It's not helping that it's taking forever to pick up these flowers. Would you like help? I'll be okay. I just need to be smart about this. Well, please do. We can't particularly afford to die at this point. Oh, I know. Kind of brings down a lot of our survivability for winter. Jeez, two tier threes. I'll be okay though. 
does not inspire confidence. Are the mushrooms though? Which is good because crockpot dishes and whatnot. Also good that we're stockpiling uh butterfly wings while we still can. Why is that? Because we can't get them in winter. True. There's a lot of things you can't get in winter. Well, that journey doubled as extra food gathering and also kind of mapping out more area. So it's a win-win-win sort of deal. I'm also mapping out more of this deciduous biome because I'm trying to find some green mushrooms to restore a majority of my sanity right now. Uh, I've got a couple back home. Green mushrooms? Uh, yeah. I'll find a bit more just while I'm out. Okay. Ooh, we don't have room for that. If you can, please do try to hurry home. I'm nearby. I'm just saying. Oh, that is a food that I can eat that's healing. Not as good as uh, butter muffins, at least I don't think, but still pretty good. Froggle bunwitches, Evan. Oh, froggle bunwitches? Yeah, they just take forever to cook, unfortunately. Well, yeah. Uh, I, su I suppose I'll try to make a few, just for convenience sake. Yeah, they give a bit of health. Like, two or three should be enough as Wigfred. Wouldn't you say? Yeah. <laughs> Considering the absolutely insane lifesteal ability. We should be able to do stuff. Do you still need those green mushrooms? I do. Okay, let me cook them up for you. Here you are. I see that Terbeak following yeah. me. Yeah. Just barely, but... He's been chasing me. Well, that's rather rude. Not drop. Come on. Put in the crock pot, please. So, yeah. Let me make some helmets and stuff for us. Is that because of you? I already dealt with mine. Here's yours, good sir. Thank you. I'll take a fresh one. And then, here's a battle spear. One should be enough. Yeah. Considering there's two of us, and it's only got, what, 5,000 health? We should be able to easily defeat it with just one per person. Doesn't sound too bad. Get out of here. Thank you. Shadow hands are so annoying, dude. Just cooking up a few more uh, butter muffins, and then we should be good. Where's that frog pond again? Oh, it's just over here. Why am I worried about it? Do you want a winter hat? Yes, please. Oh, easy kill on the frog. I mean, it always is, but... Still. Killed it before he could even lick me, and it aggroed on me first. So if that doesn't speak volumes about the ability of Wigfred, I don't know what will. I'm sure it speaks a lot. Oh, that other frog was too far away to even notice. Interesting. You want a plum pudding cap? Festive, why not? Sure. Alright, I'm almost fully healed. Your winter hat will be next to the tree. Okay. Don't get it confused. I will. So many butterflies. Die. Well, that'll conclude this episode. Next episode, for sure, we're going to be fighting. A lot of this Eye was of just terror. preparation. Yeah. But hey, next episode, we will fight the Eye of Terror. So, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like and subscribe. And we'll see you guys in the next one. See you guys. See ya.